hello friends welcome to another tutorial on FreeCAD and in this tutorial we will understand about the workbench so what are the workbench so basically uh, FreeCAD is like a modern design softwares like uh, Katia and Revit and workbenches can be considered as a set of tool especially good for the certain task so if you open the FreeCAD and here you can see lots of workbenches architectural workbench, draft workbench, dimension and drawing workbench, image workbench, part workbench, FEM workbench. <coughs> so it's depend upon for which purpose you are using the FreeCAD. So if we look for the Wikipedia page of the FreeCAD so we can find out that there are the lots of workbenches are listed here and you can know about these workbenches and basically if you are using a workbench for uh, part designing so you can uh, set your workbench default part design workbench so whenever you launch the your free cat you your default workbench will be active for example if you are uh, if you are using for uh, architectural purpose and you do not require this part design part or other workbenches okay so your default architectural workbench will be active if you are using uh, machining purpose of the part FreeCAD if you are using to generate the CNC code how your part will be get manufactured so if you are using path workbench and you are not interested in other workbench then then you can set this workbench as your default so whenever you launch your FreeCAD this this workbench will act active automatically so let's know how we can set our default workbench in FreeCAD so whenever uh, you install the FreeCAD then your default workbench will be the start this means that uh, you have to activate your workbench to start your work either it is part part design FEM architectural whatever okay so let's see how we can set our default workbench so to so set your default workbench you have to go to the edit and then preferences and under preferences under journal tab you will find that auto load module after startups so here my default workbench is a part and let's say I <coughs> I change my workbench to part design to architectural and I apply and okay okay please remember in a mind that whenever you change your default work uh, change your default workbench you have to restart your free cap <coughs> so never forget to restart your free get whenever you change your default workbench so this is the very small tutorial about how to how to set your default workbench if you like my video then please subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon so whenever i upload a new video you will get notifications thank you for watching and thank you for your valuable time